Finally, the fourth area of the forecast dashboard is the data area. Data area is comprised of three panels, the worksheet, the sales, and the purchasing panel, all of which you can add widgets from the left-hand side over to the panels. Generally, it is considered a good idea to leave the forecast worksheet panel dedicated to the forecast worksheet. Then you have the sales panel, which focuses on data concerning sales. The trends, uh, the forecasts, rolling averages for the sales momentum, uh, cases sold last year, etc. And then the purchasing panel, which focuses on data concerning purchasing to match the trending needs going forward. And from here you can see the quantities on hand, uh, what the sales forecast is going to be, um, what your uh, target days on hand might be, and what your simulated order quantity could be if you want to play around with the numbers for your purchases. If you use the Miller uh, WOQs, those numbers will be re reflected in the on order for each time period.